Our Tennessee family is united in its goals, but divided in the right path to get there. I love Tennessee too much to let her stay divided. That is why I accept the university's decision that, is, that this will be my last season as Tennessee's head football coach. This was not an easy decision. This was something that happened very quick. I really believe that this is probably the only place that I would have left here to go, was to go to Southern Cal. Thanks again for I have found in, in anything in life, uh, you, you have uh, those moments in time where you deal with change or adversity or opportunity and it's how you respond to those that ultimately matters. This is a great football coaching job. Tennessee football is not going away. We've had unbelievable success for a number of years. We're going to continue to have great success in the months and years ahead. That's a fact. Okay. Is with all the gloom and doom that's been going around here, this is still Tennessee. It was Tennessee before I got here. Uh, it's Tennessee now. Uh, and it will be Tennessee long after I'm gone. And that's special. Uh, and the people, it, it's, it's not the coaches. It's, it's the fan base, it's the institution, and it's the players. It, um, it's been a whirlwind 56 hours since we stood next door and and had the press conference about uh, getting ready to hit the road to bring a, a new coach home to the University of Tennessee. And tonight we're here to introduce the 22nd head football coach at the University of Tennessee, Derek Dooley. I'm honored to stand before you as the next head football coach at the University of Tennessee. Uh, we're going to represent this institution with class on and off the field, uh, and we're going to be a fun team to watch. There's going to be bumps along the way. There always is. Uh, but I can assure you that we're going to continue to forge ahead and I'm excited about what the future holds at Tennessee. Tyler Bray this week. I just feel like that that's the best thing for our team. 
right now. You know, the facts are the facts. I mean, we're, we're, we won two games. Until a quarterback says, Coach, you're an idiot for not playing me all four quarters by his play, then we'll just keep sorting through it. Thank you. 